Well, hello. It's 25th of December, Christmas Day. I've opened all my presents. It's all Star Wars pajamas, Star Wars slippers. You name it, Star Wars. Uh, anyway, just want to wish everyone a happy Christmas and hope you're tucking into your turkey or whatever you're going to eat for your Christmas meal. Yeah, I've never ever seen this yard so quiet. Very eerie, not having uh, diggers running up and down the key. Yeah, just um, what I really wanted to do was to remind everyone of the uh, 500 sub giveaway that I'm doing. It closes on the 29th and the draw will be done on the 30th. Uh, so uh, if you haven't um, entered the competition, follow the link in the description, uh, go to that video and leave a comment or your answers to the two questions that I posted, sorry, uh, for the two questions that I posted. Uh, I shouldn't have eaten, I, I, uh, they've got a plate of, um, nuts and raisins and I took a, a small handful before I came up. I shouldn't have done that. Um, anyway, yes, it's very quiet here. Um, there's virtually no traffic. I can't hear any traffic. There is a motorway. I'll, um, I'll go over this way. Make sure I don't fall over. Yeah. Um, I think it's the M25, is it? Or is it the M27? One of those two, anyway. The one's along the south coast. It's behind me, over there. Um, if I turn around this way, should be able to see it. Yeah, the, uh, there's the, the big motorway that runs along from Portsmouth towards Brighton. And from this direction, it goes from Portsmouth over to uh, Southampton and Poole area. Uh, it's, uh, there's not a lot of traffic on the motorway. There is a few cars coming off the motorway to come up, come down the uh, Eastern Road, I expect, uh, down into Portsmouth, but not much traffic. Not uh, not compared to what it was a few days ago when we were in last. Uh, we could see the <coughs> the motorway at full swing. Yeah, so everyone's uh, having a good time. Anyway, I'm going to turn the camera around and I'll show you some of the dredge equipment while I'm while there's nobody working. I'll show you some of the dredge equipment. Hold on. Well, here we go. Well, I wander down here. And have a good look at the dredge head here. If I extend my, extend my pole a little bit more, we can see closer up. Yeah, there you go. It's a few um, big boulders jammed in there. And that's basically that's the that's the bit that sits on the seabed sucking up all the sand. Obviously water's drawn up through this pipe here which is <clears throat> lowered down to the seabed and it gets pumped into here through those big pipes. There. There you go. This is uh, this bit here is uh, a uh, a trolley that a digger used to sit on and it would roll itself up and down digging out the cargo and dropping it onto those con those conveyor belts and then discharging it ashore um, manually ashore uh, self discharging anyway right so we're walking back slowly walking back to the accommodation block <coughs> And there we go, that's a life, this is a rescue boat, I wouldn't say it was a life, life raft, the res life rafts are up there, so if you have to abandon ship, the, uh, you, those, you just roll those into the sea and they will inflate and you all clamber in. 
Not that I've ever done that in real life. I've only done it in practice. But yeah, all that over there is, uh, that's Hailing Island over this way. And across there is the bridge that goes across to Hailing Island. And uh, I don't know if you can make out, it's quite a way off. And of course, action cameras aren't renowned for their thing. But right over there is the, uh, one of the few bridges over onto Portsmouth Island itself. Not a lot of people know that Portsmouth is an island. And you've got two road bridges, motorway bridge, and uh, of course a railway bridge. Right, that's it, I'm going in. I'll speak to you all later. Have a nice Christmas, bye.